Okay, so we are in the coffee making class. So he was telling me there's a difference between fragrance and aroma. Fragrance is the smell that you have in the bag from the air. Aroma is when you're actually brewing it. So right now we have two different types and he's trying to teach me how to smell different ingredients and uh, roasts and all that kind of stuff in the actual fragrance. And you actually have to move it around, kind of like wine, you have to let the air get to it. This one to me is, feels a little darker and burnt almost. This one. Feels like it has a lot more aroma. No, fragrant. I have no idea. Yeah, it's more coffee. Only the tote phone grounds and put in your single glass. Uh, the smoky one? Yes. Okay. Well, the first six. Oh. <laughs> yes, exactly. It's like, so take the ground grounds. Grounds and put it in this cup. In this cup. Okay. Why is it waste? If you can taste this phone grounds a lot in your palate, you don't feel good. Okay. This is when you take the coffee with me, you taste only only coffee. And please only the top. Huh? How is Colombia? Is this your first time? <laughs> okay, my friend, when you change the glass, clean the spoon and clean your belly up. Okay. Alright. So sweet, bitter, and acid. and acid. Acid, bitter, sweet. Okay. And then okay. Exactly. Alright. So. That tastes, I think, bitter. Okay. But we're gonna try the other one. <laughs> My palate might not be very good. I might have a very uh, normal palate. Let's see. <laughs> I don't know. Let me do it again. Okay. I taste the difference. I'm trying to describe the difference. Um, I like this one more. This one tastes more, maybe more bitter or acidy. Okay. And then this one maybe a little bit sweeter. Okay. And that's why I like it more. Maybe I okay. don't know. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Which is more bitter? I feel like this one tastes a little bit more okay. bitter. You think tastes acid and whiskey? I don't know what acid tastes like. Good coffee. Good coffee. Good coffee. Because I'll explain later. Okay, so your mains are your bitters, your sweets, and your acids. So if it's really dark, it usually means it's not like a dark coffee. It was just burnt and bitter. It's usually not good. But the lighter it is, like that one, this is the better one. It's the sweeter one with nothing in it. And then that one's the darker one. On the side, though, they have these candles. This is a sweet cinnamon candle. It smells delicious. That's made out of vegetable wax. And so you can put it, um, put a little bit in my hand, and like. This coffee. Brother Morgan. Okay. This one is solid variety. So we gain with 40 hours in fermentation process. Okay. Full gas, medium roast. Okay. After roast, one week. When you use paper filter at home, please wash the paper filter. Okay, before. Before. Okay. Before. Put the coffee in the metal. Okay. Why? For you not contaminate the coffee with paper flavor. Gotcha. And give me flavor and hot the glass. Why? Here in the glass. For you can feel more consistent flavor for more time. Okay. No more. Thanks gotcha. for it. Okay. And please no use this water for no loss of your job. Yeah, for that. Yeah. I know you use this. Got it. And then, one moment, and here's my coffee. Okay. Paper filter. 
iPhone. Japanese iPhone. Again, same thing as before. Clean the, or clean the paper. Yes. And then we're wiring the board. Okay. That's all, we cut. Okay. Then, I, I use one, I start my plane. For the water. water in the relationship 10 percent 10 percent coffee per my quantity in water today i use 10 percent got it yes. then my idea when you're making coffee at home pour the water in two different times okay. number one pre-infusion and number two infusion and your pre-infusion you can look it's possible you can use double quantity in water per your quantity in coffee okay. by the idea Put a little water for burn the gas, this is too. So this was made with this. It's very soft. I, I describe it almost like a tea. No bitters. It's really good. The problem in channel in in the method. In diffusion and over expression and expression a little bit. Because you don't want you don't want too much oxygen. On, yeah, exactly. And yeah. slowly. Slowly. Because this is more balanced coffee. Last acid a little bit more sweet like a caramel okay. and a little bit dark chocolate. And then make the coffee and appreciate this beautiful phone. Why is the reason? Fresh coffee. When you look good fun in one coffee, it's indicator of fresh coffee. A lot CO2 mm -hmm. and a lot of oil. Okay, four tips to make the best coffee at home. So first, you're gonna have your percentage, which is what we would call a ratio. So you want to have seven, eight, or 10%, and that's gonna be light, medium, dark. And then you're gonna have um, the grain, the size, so you, um, the more fine, like powder, all the way up to um, what you would use in a French press, which is like the grains. And in the middle, you have like sugar. And then um, the third thing is gonna be, uh, let's see, the temperature. No, no, the time, the time. The third is time. So if you're doing the really fine, it's gonna be 30 seconds to a minute. If you're using the middle, it's gonna be three to five minutes. And if you're gonna be using the um, stuff like the French press, you're looking at about six minutes and then the fourth step is temperature. Don't use the boiling water. Try to use, uh, boil it, and then wait 30 seconds to a minute, and then pour or use that water um, for your coffee. Because if you use boiling water, it's gonna get bitter and taste burnt. So there's your four tips to make the best coffee at home, brought to you by this lovely place. Okay, so turn the flame off on this contraption. And we put the coffee on the top where the water boiled up. We dipped it slowly and then we stirred it. We don't want to get too much oxygen in it. So then we took the flame out and now it's going to gravity feed back down. go to a coffee shop, you're going to ask them about the SCA chart and see what they say. If they don't know what you're talking about, you need to go to another place because they don't know what they're talking about. 